<laughs> Welcome guys, we're about to do a porno. Take one. We only do one takers one. <coughs> one, two, three. Hello guys. Hi guys, welcome back. It's been a while that we've been posting. It's probably been like a month now. It's been longer than a month. I think like a month. A month and some weeks. A month and some weeks that we have not posted. And we have not posted without an explanation telling you guys why we didn't post this. We just literally went off the grid and just left. Yeah, some of our friends, number one fans like Charlie, the, the tow truck guy, would be like, hey, what's going on? Why you guys haven't posted? And then I would be like, you know, we're gonna get on it, blah, blah, blah. But I feel like a reason that we just stopped posting was the channel was heading the wrong direction. By the wrong direction, we mean that like, we were not putting in our 100% into our videos. And that was mainly because we kept clashing as a duo. Uh, we were not working as a team. We didn't take the channel as this channel is equally mine as it is his and it was mainly like well I want this and you want this and I want this but I want this and then our videos really just became like half-assed let's reach this deadline we have to post tomorrow we have to post tomorrow we haven't recorded anything what are we gonna post tomorrow and we just ended up losing like an interest that way what I feel that happened was the channel originally started it, it was me and you. We're going to show the lifestyle that, we, that we're living and uh, the journey of us growing the channel. But it shifted towards just me and my friends just lifting and then we like took Jess out of the picture and it just became us just lifting and having fun. Don't get us wrong, like, the channel is about us powerlifting and everything that goes along with it like between us uh, but because our we kept clashing it just became worse that way and it just became really frustrating and overwhelming and we just got off the grid and felt like we needed a break um, it really wasn't fair on you guys that we didn't give an explanation but we just really needed to like take a step back like think about why we make these videos for who we make these videos and what we want these videos to be about and especially to like make sure that me and Soto are both on the same page and that we give 100% into the content that we create. And uh, a lot of the times I like, felt like we were not going forward and we are not going back like we were just in the middle like stuck see all my friends you know, going forward with their lives. We want to make this our career. If we're not putting out YouTube videos, how are we going to go forward? And I would always talk to Jess and tell her like, you know, we got to get back on it. We got to get back on it. But you know, here we are. We finally decided that we're going to start making YouTube videos again because we, honestly, I missed it. I missed it too. It felt like, 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 yeah, the days would go by and then sort of would do stuff. But like, it was like, like damn, like we wish we wish we had a camera behind us and like, because I really felt like it connected us together even like like as a stronger couple. It connected our friends together as a stronger bond because everyone just just wanted to know what the next video was. Everyone was like, you know, we had little things that that like people knew we recorded. And it's just like, hey, do you want to be in this video? Do you mind if we record you? And it was like a connection with everyone. And that's something that we really missed, especially because we used to post like five days a week and it was just a routine that we just completely stopped doing and it was just really off for us to like not take the camera. Like this, the camera we're recording on literally sat on our desk like untouched for the entire time that we did not uh, like post. So like we completely stopped. It wasn't that we were filming and just never posted, it was like no, we completely 100% stopped. Yeah, I and mean, we really felt like you needed an explanation on why we stopped and to let you know, you know, like this video is not just explaining like the reason, but it's also letting you know like this is the comeback and this is like we're coming back, coming back stronger and with better content. But what's something new that that has that we haven't told the fans? Well, one with you, with me. Uh, my hair's not blue anymore. Pink. That's something new. Uh, I will be competing in the Inland Empire Open Meet. I am four weeks out. Soto's not my coach. 
Yep, not her coach. I fired her. She just wasn't a good athlete. I couldn't deal with her. You know, I want her. Hey, I can't do this. I can't do that. I'm uh, training for a competition in January. I'm gonna do a Cap Pendleton. I've been out like a whole year already, and I just want to step on the platform again. Because as you guys she remember, big numbers. yeah, as you guys remember, Soto did get injured, and uh, most of the past videos, it it was like him through his recovery, how he felt, how things felt like, and uh, he's coming back, and he's gonna do the same week he did last year. The goal forever was to hit a 600 and I hit a 605. So I'm probably shooting around a 640, 650 in Camp easy Pendleton. Too. That was easy. The hard decision is should I do raw or should I do classic raw? Ooh, that's one thing. So as you guys know, we both and uh, we both and Dali would do uh, classic raw. So we'd compete in Iraq. This coming meet that I have in December is going to be my first raw meet, so I will be competing in sleeves for the first time. My coach, I get coached by Andy, aka the huge Asian guy on Instagram. Uh, so far, it's been really great with him. Like I've really seen an improvement in my lifts and just overall, like just the way everything feels, my form or my technique, everything just feels a lot better. Uh, recently. I've hit in the gym uh, a 345 for a triple, like in deadlifts. And I've hit a 295 for a double in squats and a 155 for two singles in bench. I'm thinking about was posting twice a week. So we'll we be posting Tuesdays <laughs> and Thursdays. Yeah, it's going to be more like our lifestyle and just what we enjoy, like maybe cooking, or doing some food challenges because we always we have always loved to eat and eat in different places, explore new foods. Mm -hmm. So stuff like that, maybe even throwing some skits too. Like since we started the channel, our we wrote down like a shit ton of skits that we were gonna do and we have never gone through. Because we always thought like, oh we're gonna take our, our channel in a different direction. But you know what? Like it's something that we always wanted to do and it's like why like keep that away from you guys if it's like we have all these ideas in our head and um that's something that like we will really like bring out and like pay more attention to like if that's something that we like like why not show you <laughs> oh, me and Gary are planning on starting our own channel and it's probably just gonna be about us fucking messing around not fucking around messing around in the gym being ourselves, being loud, lifting weights, having a good time. So stay tuned for the launch date on that channel. Uh, we still don't know, or sorry, they don't know, so it's not my channel. We still have to do business meetings yeah. and decide. Decide on the name and whatever they're planning to do. But that is the update on the whole shebang, on why we left you guys. But we want you back and we're coming back better and stronger and just, just more better. So, more better for you. We will be most likely uh, posting this video on Thursday because it is Tuesday. And like I said, Tuesdays and Thursdays, posting new videos. Stay tuned for all of them. And that's it. That's it. Like and share the videos!